Here's a Google Nest Cam for indoor. It is wired and I just changed my Wi-Fi information the other day so I'm going to show you how to update the cam, okay? You'll be able to update your uh, Wi-Fi password as well as your SSID or network name. Now the only way that I found out how to do this is we have to go ahead and reset this, okay? So just make sure you have your uh, Google Home app downloaded, okay? So make sure you have that. So now we're gonna go ahead and reset this, okay? So make sure it's plugged in. I have power here, and if you look, there's a little tiny pinhole right on you here. You wanna grab yourself like a SIM ejection tool to take out your SIM card on your phone, your iPad or tablet, that should work, or like a, uh, like a paper clip like this will work as well, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and put this into the hole, and I think I have to wait till the light turns orange, okay? Right now it's green, I'm gonna put it in there, ready? I feel that little click, I'm holding it now, and I'm gonna keep holding it here until it resets, okay? Still holding here. Okay, now, once you hear that, now pull it out, okay? And the light is now orange. And the light there just turned off, okay, it's turning back on now. So what we wanna do is uh, open up your home app, and, uh, Google Home app, and then go to devices, and then click on add down here, okay? So we're gonna tap on add. We're gonna click in the middle one here, Google Nest or Partner Devices, right there. Choose the address, I'm good with that one there. My address, let's hit next. Also note that it's blue now, the light. Looking for devices. It's not gonna find it because we're not connected to the internet. Okay, now this pops up here and we're gonna go ahead and select it, uh, camera. This is the Nest Cam Indoor Wired second generation. Now we gotta scan a QR code, which I don't know where it's at, so we're gonna to have to go ahead and set up without QR code. So tap down here. And now we need to get those six digits. It's under here, okay? So this plate, bottom plate, pops off, lefty-loosey, tighty-righty. So let me turn it to the left here. And I see my setup code, six digits, right there. So let me input mine in. And once you do that, tap on next. Next cam wired, tap on next. Additional legal terms, read through that. If you agree, tap on I agree. Usage guidelines, read through that. If you agree again, tap on I agree. Privacy guidelines, same thing. Go down to next. Help improve next cam. Uh, this is optional. You go no thanks or yes. I mean, it doesn't matter. I, I'll just go with no thanks. Plug in the camera near the spot that you plan to use it. Okay. And it says down here the camera will chime once it turns blue. Leave it plugged in and proceed. So it's blue now. We had it blue, so we're gonna go ahead and tap on next here. And now we just gotta wait. It says connect to your Wi-Fi. Now the thing is, when I um, reset my doors, uh, doorbell, I saved my new information to the Google Cloud, okay? So that's my, uh, it's saved. But if you have a new SID or network name, look for it down here, okay? Mine's right there. Look for the new one and then put your new password in, okay? But again, mine's saved on Google because I just reset my other, um, my doorbell camera. So now it's connecting to my new Wi-Fi, new password. So it's connected. Finishing up. Oh, I just heard a little chime on the camera. And the light just turned green. And it says devices getting your device ready. Where's the device? Go ahead and choose. I'm just gonna go with Office. I'm gonna tap on Next. And it's just some information. You can go ahead and read through that if you wish. You should now see your live video. Yep, that's me. We're up and running. There you go. Hope you guys got everything in working order now.